Online News Update. Okay, folks, this is Mid-Afternoon Update for TFNN. Larry Pesavento reporting. I have a lot of things to talk about today, folks. First of all, we have a collapse going on in the Treasury bonds and Treasury notes. And I think I have to give an award to Bill Ackman for being the bravest man in the world for poking the bear. And he actually said that he was heavily short the Treasury notes and Treasury bonds. And he says that right in front of the United States Treasury. Are you kidding me, Bill? Keep it to yourself, my son. They don't need to know what you're doing. So be careful what you ask for, my friend. And if he, he, he might even use this break to cover his shorts. We do not know that. The market is acting incredibly bullish given the fact that the bonds uh, had a tremendous move to the downside, folks. Just absolutely total collapse. Uh, we're down near the lows that we made three and a half months ago. We get below that 117 layer, uh, level, folks. You're going to be looking at interest rates you're not going to believe, but uh, that's neither here nor there. We're not there yet. And so that's the main thing that we're paying close attention to here today. So be very, very close uh, to what's going on because we've got a lot of action going on in the market. Today's low uh, in the S&P 500 was a 61% uh, retracement or the low we made two weeks ago. It was also a 1.618 expansion. And if you take a look at the NASDAQ chart, we made the biggest ABCD correction that we've made in the last uh, six or seven months today, right on the opening. And that's the reason why we're having such a strong move going on in the markets here today. This could all end in a heartbeat. Uh, also, gold is down a little bit. Silver is down a little bit. But the rest of the markets, the grains are down. Eh, some, of, some of the grains are down. And there's a few of the grains. Uh, and the only grain that is up is, uh, is a spot soybeans. But... Wheat corn are also down. So this is real negative uh, financial markets for the commodities, but the others are okay. The U.S. dollar has uh, weakened a bit. Uh, we got strength now in all of the major currencies, which is not unexpected because if you take a look at that dollar index chart, it certainly looked like it was topping uh, last night, and that's pretty much what's been going on here so far today. So that's what we're paying attention to. I want to thank everybody that joined the show yesterday. We had a good day. We covered the uh, cost of commission plus a couple of bucks. And boy, we came so close to a couple of really monster wins, missing them by about $30, believe it or not. Anyway, we'll be right back with uh, Trade What You See. Stay tuned. 877-927-6648. 